In this tutorial, we're going to see how to access some of the reports that have been preloaded into your Yellowfin dashboards. When Impos sets up your venue with Yellowfin, you will have five dashboards preloaded with many different reports in each. To access this, of course, you'll first need to log in. An administrator user is created by default during the installation process. Once you've logged in with the credentials provided to you by the Impost Tech Team, you'll have access to all of your default dashboards. Inside these dashboards, you'll find your reports. To access these, you'll need to open the dashboard and hover the mouse over the report you'd like to edit. From here, you have a range of options to access information within these reports. By accessing the downward arrow, we are presented with options to export, share, and print the report. This icon will toggle the view from a chart to a report view. To change the views for your dashboards, you can do so by selecting the options on the drop down menus from the tabs. You can also add a filter to the report. Now, a filter is just a set of restrictions that allow the user to look at specific information. This is asking us to select which store or venue's information we'd like to look at. Once we have set the filter, we can press the plus button, which will maximise the report, allowing you to drill down further on more data within the report. As you can see, there are some date fields that you can manipulate and the metrics of category and department for you to examine. These are user prompted filters for this particular report. Now that we've selected that, we'd like to drill down on department. Click on the department in the data and we can see that the platform will update and the table information will display. From there, we can export this by pressing the export button. This will allow you to select the format you'd like to export this in. The platform will then ask for you to add recipients to receive the report URL, or you can extract an embed code if desired. When ready to close the report, simply press the X button in the top right hand corner.